Hello, in this session, we are going to create a spiral wave using Material. First, download a plain mesh with many vertices from our Discord or find one, then import it into the project and create a Material. To use the Opacity feature, set the shading model to Translucent. And for an early check on the World Position Offset feature, set the imported mesh as the preview mesh. Create a vector to radial value node to convert the UV to circular. Then, to make a spiral, connect the breakout float to components node so that different values can be set in each channel. Next, create an add node. Then add each channel from the vector to radial value node and connect the sign node to create a spiral gradient. Next, create a multiply node, set the values to the node, and connecting it between the vector. To radial value nodes, as shown in the video, will extend the UV. Then, to move this spiral form, connect the panner node to the multiply node. Next, create another multiply node set values to it, and connect it to the green channel of the breakout float to components node to straighten the twisted spiral form slightly. Then, use the power node to make the spiral form increasingly twisted as it goes outward. Next, to set the color, create a multiply node and a constant three vector node. You can create the constant three vector node by holding the three key and clicking. After setting the desired color in the constant three vector node, use the multiply node to multiply it with the sign node and add color to the spiral gradient. Then use multiply and parameter nodes to adjust the brightness of the color. You can create the parameter node by holding the S key and clicking. Next, let's create a masking gradient to use for opacity and world position offset. Create two radial gradient exponential nodes to create a circular gradient. By holding the one key and clicking, create a constant node. Reduce one radius using the constant node, then use the subtract node to subtract the two circular gradients from each other to form a torus shape. Next, use a multiply node to multiply the sign node and the torus shaped gradient. Then, connect the multiply node to opacity to create the spiral model. To create a world position offset effect, create a vertex normal node and create two multiply nodes and a parameter node. Then, as shown in the video, set the values in the parameter node and connect the nodes. Now, you can see the material has an elevated appearance according to the parameter value. Next, return to the content drawer, create an instance of the material, and place the imported mesh in the level. Finally, set the material instance to the mesh placed in the level and adjust the parameter in the material instance to set the height of the material. 